You know, everybody talks about this like there are no numbers. Obama said it's very important for us to align ourselves with the 99.9% .9 of Muslims who are looking for the same thing we're looking for, order, peace, prosperity. I love the president, but he just pulled that number right out of his ass. Uh, there are numbers. We had a guest on a couple of weeks ago, Rohil Raza. She is a woman who runs the, there she is, the uh, Clarion Project. Uh, she goes by the numbers. That's what her video was called. 53% of the population of 39 Muslim countries that were surveyed want Sharia law. Um, Sharia law, death for leaving Islam, death for insulting the Prophet or the Koran, stoning a woman to death for adultery, amputation for theft, whipping for missing Friday prayers or, or drinking alcohol. Um, the numbers vary from country to country, but this idea that it's just this small problem, the reason why this is a unique problem, why I was imploring Cory Booker to say that, is because it is a distinct thread based on the size. The New York Times says there are 5,000 militant Islamic groups in the world, armies like Boko Haram and ISIS and the Taliban and Al-Qaeda. Intent, they want to get nuclear weapons, support from the local population. I'm not saying most people want to commit terrorist acts. I'm saying they have illiberal ideas that are sometimes in line with what the terrorists believe. And recent events. Well, no, one's denying, no one's denying any of this, but here's well, how... Oh, well, yes, well, they are. There, well, there's some people...